Hello friends, how are you? Today, how to make motorcycle bumper or learn it by SolidWorks. At first, open the SolidWorks software, then go to File and click New and click Part and click OK. Now go to Front Plane and Scale. Now draw the line here towards it. Select. Now give the dimension this line 400. Okay, select. Now this line select midpoint. Control this point. Coincident. Okay. Now draw the line here. Draw the line here. Make arc here. And and here and here. Select. Now this line dimension. 300 okay. now this line and this line this line and this line dimension 120 select okay select now this line control this line Tangent. Okay. Now this line and this line degree fifteen. Okay, select. Now this line dimension hundred ten. Okay. Now there I need fully defined. Okay. Now give the dimension give the dimension this line three hundred sixty. Okay, select. Now this line midpoint control this origin point vertical okay now go to fillet tools use here. select give the dimension 60 60 now we can have 60 okay okay now draw the center line here select make center line now go to mirror this line this line and this line and this select and this select about center line okay now make our space now go to exit and click right plane and this case go to normal tool and draw the circle here give the circle dimension 26 okay select now 
this point control this line yes okay now they are fully defined now go to feature and exit you can use sweep bus now there are profile this circular profile and this is path click here select okay now go to isometric view now now click from plane and sketch now again draw the circle draw the circle here circle here select now keep the dimension of this circle 26 okay now this point and this point distance distance 53 okay select now this point control this point but here okay now go to from plane and click reference plane and exit click from plane and reference plane reference plane after 49 okay okay select now need again plane go to again from reference plane and click here click here now click there 100 ok select now again go to plane click here keep the dimension 154 154 select ok now go to this plane and sketch go to normal tool draw the ellipse here draw the hair select now give the dimension this point this point dimension 23 and this point and this point dimension 49 ok control z select now this one control this one but again okay this one and this one dimension 49 okay select now this point control this point Okay. This point control this point horizontal. Auto normal tool. This point this point horizontal. Now this point control this point coincid. Okay. Now go to go to this plane and exit and go to this plane and sketch. Go to normal tool. 
normal tool again draw the ellipse here again draw the ellipse here and here please select now give the dimension dimension this point and this point dimension relation delete this relation delete so, dimension this line and uh, this point and this point 40 44.5 this point and this point dimension 16 okay select this point control this point coincid okay this point control this point but it's a fully defined now go to this plane exit and go to this plane and space go to normal tool again draw the ellipse draw the ellipse click here select now give the dimension this point and this point three and this point and this point dimension thirty one okay select now this point control this point but here okay now go to exit now go to look tab and click here and click here and click here and click here ok select now this plane no need hide Height and height. Now go to right plane and click mirror and click loft it. Okay, select. Okay, now go to isometric view and click. click right plane and sketch go to normal tool and click here draw the circle for hole select now give the dimension circle 15 15 this point and this point dimension 15 select ok now this point this line select go to normal tool this point control this point horizontal now go to feature and extrude cut. We can extrude cut through all both. Okay. Select. Now go to asymmetric view. Go to asymmetric view. Now go to on plane and sketch to normal tool and draw the hair draw the 
have seventy. Now give the dimension. This line dimension hundred. This line dimension sixty. Select. This line select midpoint. Control this part. Vertical. Now go to dimension extrude and click offset set parting friction change give the dimension five okay select. to normal tools and draw the circle here for hole give the circle dimension 15 this line and this line dimension 15 and this point and this line dimension 15 okay select now we can this dimension 10 okay now go to linear pattern and click here and dimension after 70 okay With the dimension this one this one Now this part and control this part but horizontal. Okay. Now go to feature and extrude cut. Okay. Select. Make our job. Now we can use materials or color as well as now go to shaded tools. Can use color, but black color use. Okay, now we can hide. Control that. Okay. Thank you all. Thank you all. Everyone share and like. If have any ask. You can write comment box. Please subscribe my channel.